Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Malls Gadget Review Channel. Today, I'm gonna review a product that I haven't seen before, but I got it at my local Kroger store. It's the Paqui, I guess, P-A-Q-U-I. This is the Haunted Ghost Pepper. So these should be extremely, extremely spicy if it says ghost pepper. So I've never tried a chip with the term ghost pepper, at least can't remember uh, trying ghost pepper, but i uh, gonna try it out. I've had salsa, I think, with ghost pepper, but never on a chip. Real peppers, real heat, it says. This whole bag was $2.99. You get seven ounces, seven servings, 140 um, calories per serving, it says, so the ingredients look pretty good so far. Ground, ground corn, expeller pressed canola and, and or sunflower oil, salt, and it actually has ghost pepper in here. Ghost pepper, potato starch, cayenne pepper, chipotle pepper, powder, cane sugar, natural flavor, yeast extract, some flavor enhancers, onion powder, citric acid, garlic powder, chili powder. And on the scale, you can see the scale here, you have not hot, kind of hot, hot, super hot, and freaking hot. So this is going to be freaking hot, it says. Is that actually the case? You know, I'm someone that probably eats sriracha daily, I'd say. And uh, so we'll see if it actually is, is truly, truly hot. But let's pour it out on a plate so you can see it, and then give it a taste test on camera. Check that out. Nice big, big chips. Check that out. Kind of oversized. I'm gonna smell them. Don't really smell hot. I mean, I thought my nose would be like full of ghost pepper, but not really. They don't really smell, you know, they don't get up in your nose and, you know, make you wanna, like, they're not like onions or something like that. But let me try these. I'm gonna do it on camera so you can see my reaction. And here we go. Ghost pepper, haunted ghost pepper. Paku, Paku, Paqui, something like that. All right, so let's test out the haunted ghost pepper chips. Check these out. So here we go. Gonna take one of these big chips. Haven't had them before. First time. Here we go. Three, two, one. So it starts out not that hot, but then it just gradually builds. And this is a hot chip. This is a hot chip. So I'm used to sriracha, but whoa, this is hot. Kind of starts out just a corn, nice corn flavor. <clears throat> but the more you eat it, this is kind of a chip that's going to make you sweat. It's not, it's, it's riding that line of kind of being overpowering to not. So you're kind of like, oh, I want more, you know, that, that good kind of heat. It gets up in your nose a little bit and it makes it kind of hard to talk. So just riding that line of, but I'm, I can tell, I'm, I'm, I'm starting to sweat a little bit. But they're not too hot where you just put them down. You're kind of like, that was good, that was hot, let's grab another one. You know, kind of that addictive heat. Okay, this one has a lot of seasoning on it, so we'll check this one out. Oh yeah. Yeah, your mouth is just full of this ghost pepper flavor, ghost pepper heat, and uh, not overpowering, not the hottest thing I've, I've eaten, you know, but as far as the chip goes, that's probably one of the hottest chips I've had. All right, so I'm sweating, I'm still sweating, my mouth is burning, still burning, but yeah, do I recommend the Paqui? or however you pronounce that. I'm sure someone's gonna leave a comment. So if you have the pronunciation, let me know. The haunted ghost pepper chip, real peppers, real heat. The answer is, see, I'm, it's hard to talk right now. 
Uh, the answer is yes. I'm, I'm surprised. So I like that there's actually ghost peppers in here. If it was ghost pepper flavor, like a lot of companies, they'll say something that's in there, like let's say it's blueberry, but it's not blueberry, it's blueberry flavor. I really like that they actually use ghost peppers instead of like flavoring or something like that. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm impressed with these. So yeah, I really like the flavoring. I think that it's a kind of a satisfying flavor. Uh, there's a lot of heat. So if you like hot, hot sauces, I think this is a great thing. I mean, you could probably pair this with guacamole. I think that would go really well, actually. Um, yeah, great flavor, great corn taste. I like these, and I do recommend them. Let me know what you think if you had these. If you like this video from the company, send me some more. I'd like to test them out. Uh, but if you'd like to support my content, go to patreon.com slash If you like reviews like this, if I've ever saved you money, do me a favor, go to patreon.com and support me there. From a dollar, that's all it takes. You get exclusive videos, exclusive content. Check it out. You can also become a Facebook fan. Check that out as well. And you can support me on, see even the dogs like it. See the dogs in the background. Uh, so yeah, you can shop my videos on Amazon. You can watch or, or get the products that I reviewed. Check them out. And yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Let me know what you think of these. Leave in the comment section. And until next time, I'll see you later.